Hello, one and all, this is Warren Botacos, and welcome back to Let's Play Thief Gold. When we last left off, we were still here in the Bonehorn. Probably gonna be here for quite a bit longer. We had found a quicker escape route that we will probably be using when it's time to leave. I say probably because I might have to. I might have to backtrack uh, to some of the previous areas to try to find something that I've missed. So, aside from that, that looks like a good place to be. Okay, I'm lying. It doesn't look like a good place at all, but we're going to go there anyways. We're going to go there from a nice side, because I don't want to be caught in those eyes. Did I just rhyme and I didn't do it intentionally? See? The game already warned me. I am staying away. I got more rope arrows. That'll help me get out. Did I get anything important? No. I'm feeling so sorry. Are you done making me feel sorry yet? Goodbye, spooky voice. I'll be leaving now. Well, we can count that area as taken care of. Where on the map am I considered still just in that big spot? Let's jump up here. See if I can get my arrow back. And I can! Always good. And let's make an official save here. We have now officially covered over the first official save I made for this level. Right. So we've been up there. We know where that leads, so there's no reason to go down there again. Where have we not been to? I believe we've been up there to an extent. I remember the, the shitty little pillar things, but let's come down here. Right. There is a zombie over here. Let's make a quick save in case the zombie decides to get up. We have been up there. Stay down, boy. Nope, I got up. I delayed too long. I'm gonna fall to my death now. That seems like the best option. I do want to go back up there. Goodbye, zombie. Garrett, thank you. We went down that way. That led to one of the mystic things. Did we go down that way? Yes, we did, but I don't remember what we found. We found something. Alright, let's go there again. Um, the game nearly crashed on me there. Don't do that game. Nope. The only place that, in my mind, that I could not thoroughly explore up to now was the frickin' room with the fire guy. Oh, I remember that way. That direction was with the Burks. This should miss me. There is something in that direction, but I cannot make that jump. run from this point. We should go check out what these barks are doing. 
I wanted to wait on it, but I don't think I have that luxury at the moment. Maybe with any luck they won't see me. I'm waiting for it to come up behind me because they just totally should have saw me. Well, this area is considered dark. This area is considered not so dark. There is something behind them. I'm going to get seen here. I should have been seen several times over by now. Maybe the noise going on in the background is supposed to represent the horn keeping them tame. It's possible. Come on, Garrett. Up you go. Or maybe I'm just that good. Yeah, I think that noise is supposed to be the horn. I'm keeping an eye on you, statues. Anything up top? Nope. Good thing I'm not afraid of heights. Um, speak for yourself, Garrett. I'm uh, totally afraid to take you up heights. Because you have trouble coming down. And sometimes you have trouble coming up. This will be where the horn is. I'm almost sure of it. If my memory about this game were fresher, I would be sure of it. But I tend to block these zombie-filled levels from my mind. Save for the fact that they exist. Which is unfortunate. But it is the reality of the situation. Oh, there's the ladder. I walked right into it and I would have kept walking if I didn't bump it. Huzzah. Might as well start running. There it is. Nope, nope, that's the one I used to get here, so I must have missed it. Looking for it on like the center pillar. There it is. I see it. Hit climbing, Garrett. Oh boy. This will be the one that kills me. <clears throat> nope. See, Garrett, I told you I was afraid of heights with you. <gasps> oh, what? Y you held it? Finish the job, thief! Good. Worth quick saving again. Oh! What? Get it! Oh, come on! That was easy mode. <sighs> come on, thief! <gasps> you taffer! Oh, no way this ends well. No way. <clears throat> yeah, I didn't think that was gonna happen. Am I okay taking that damage? No, no I'm not. Not for something that silly. You lie to me, Ledge. We all then use ladders. The uh, horn of Quintus, I presume. No, it's the horn of shenanigans. What do you think it was? You can play it, I believe. No, maybe you can't play it. Because I'm trying to. 
Alright, getting out of here is going to be difficult. Oh boy. I better take this from a fair height. Mm -hmm. Ah, fooey. What if I just fell? Well, I wanted you to just fall, Garrett, in that direction, but climbing that way works too. Ha, yeah! No. Yeah, uh, no. Or maybe, you know, with a run. <laughs> How many times can I make Garrett plummet and fall to his death? Quite a few, I'd rager. Quite a few. Don't you make your spooky noises at me. Where's the ladder? Oh, there it is. And... Uh, woo! I'm glad you actually managed to climb that one. I really do love this game, but man, the uh, the controls for this could be smoother. <laughs> it's the age it came from. All right, you can let go of it now, and we're out. Save in the cover of darkness. Problem is, those Burks are not going to be tamed anymore. Which means I'm probably going to get seen or heard. Or just maybe the fact that I'm carrying the horn in my inventory will keep them calm. Would like to keep it on standby though. I definitely can't play it. I am trying. If it were any other inventory item, the way I'm clicking it would have activated. Okay, pretty smooth sailing so far. Then what I went this way? Leave me alone, I have your magic horn. Yeah, apparently that's all it takes. Just having it in your inventory, because I totally should have been spotted there. Or these things are just really dumb. I don't think these things are here at all in Thief 2. Probably for the best they aren't. All right, magic horn get. Now we have to take the mystic soul and find how much more wealth. Just probably just the mystic soul. We're only a hundred shy. All right, do I like my odds of jumping back? Do I want to climb back down the ladder? No, not particularly. But this ramp leads to zombies too, doesn't it? Doesn't it? I don't remember. Perhaps not. We do need to figure out how to get over there, because I don't recall us going that way before. At least I certainly don't recall it. The thing we're looking for probably has everything to do with the angry fireman room, but currently there's nothing I can really do about that. Not until my memory cures itself up. I want to figure out how to get there. I feel like I've been up there before. 
but I must remember how. This way turns here. One of the problems with doing these videos weeks apart, as I always say, you forget certain things that you would otherwise remember if you were doing it just in this one session. Maybe I haven't been up there. Interesting. I don't think this area led to it. Or did it? Nope, it actually certainly did. Okay. Well, we know that now. And that's just a way out. Sweet. I can stop worrying about it. Yeah, the only thing we have left to worry about is the fireman room. Problem is, I don't know how to deal with that. Search just about everywhere else. I'm pretty sure of it. Map won't help me. It's just vague blobs of size. I need to figure out a way back down. I don't want to go that way. There's zombies that way. Go this way and leap. And we'll use this ramp to get down. Leave zombie man was over here anyways. Oh nope, I didn't invade the hammerite part of the map yet. Ah, oh, that's right. This doesn't end well. I remember there's a thousand good reasons not to come this way. See if I can remember them all. Oh, no doubt I'll discover them. Well, I see gold. I'm a simple man. I see money. I steal it. Where did that fire from? Well, oh, there's the holy water vat. And some more golden bones. <laughs> Am I supposed to drop the golden bones in here? I don't ever remember fiddling around with those all the other times I've played this. Well, that disappeared off the earth. So did that one. So if this is the wrong thing to do, there's no going back about it. Oh! Apparently that was the right thing to do. Fire arrows. A stash of water arrows. Thank you kindly. A holy water. Thank you. And some more fire arrows. I don't ever remember having to do that before. Maybe we can use this, although I don't think there's much reason to. I don't think there's any zombies nearby. There are ones nearby, no doubt. I'm back up to 18 arrows. I think you... There's the firing! I probably walked right into that the first time I did this, which is why I'm remembering it now. Go away, man of flame. Right. This is definitely where we need to be. As unfortunate as that reality is. I do need to scare him off. Hit him once, he gets interested. Hit him twice, he leaves. There's a fire arrow behind. Let's make an official save. And we'll function off of this as our save of scaring him off. 
And when we come back, folks, I'm going to try to figure out to do whatever it is I need to do to get those rooms open during the time that he's gone. I'll see you all later. This is Winnipeg Taco signing off. Take care and bye-bye.